you're watching Holistic Developer Channel. I'm Anna, I'm the host of this channel, and I hope that your day today is a good day. I have a good day, regardless of a few ups and downs, but it doesn't matter. At the end, it's still a good day and I'm grateful for everything. So to give you a, a broader spectrum of, <laughs> spectrum of what's going on today, earlier today I had a call with a recruiter from Google, that's the recruiter who I worked with to get my on-site interview. Um, I've done the on-site interview with Google and long story short, I didn't pass the interview. And if you want to hear the details, you can watch the video, you'll get the card here. So the story is that I got the rejection and what I decided to do, <laughs> obviously I was sad about it, but the next thing that I decided to do is actually celebrate it. And I celebrated the rejection from Google by having a cup of champagne with a lobster tail <laughs> and a piece of my favorite cake, uh, tiramisu. So I celebrated that together with my husband and I decided to do something interesting. So while I was figuring out what to do, how I feel, I decided um, to kind of scroll the internet and I came across this 101 tips to make you a better developer. So what else can you do when you got the rejection? Like you obviously want to see how to become better at something and that's what is this video about. So I kind of want to see, I will give a score to this 101 tips to become a better software engineer and we'll see how I'm doing. So this is a post by Simon Holdorf. I hope I pronounced the name correctly. You will find the links to this post to this blog so you can read it yourself if you want and yeah let's begin so um the very first one is that try to understand get concepts i'll have a, a check there learn the concepts of clean code check build a portfolio site check uh, write a technical blog post um i do plan to do it i haven't done one yet uh, so in progress so zero so far uh get your first freelance gig I have not had any freelance gigs um, and I don't know if I want to do it, honestly, but obviously it's a tip to become better, so I should consider it. Learn the JavaScript foundations, check. Learn one uh, big JavaScript uh, framework, check. So I, I know React, I'm continuing to learning, so it doesn't mean that I know it, like I'm an expert in it, but I'm confident in it. So check there. Uh, try to move to a senior position, Check. <laughs> Mentor junior developers. Check. Create a tutorial for others. I uh, haven't done that publicly, but I did that uh, privately, so I won't count that. I should probably create one for you all, so <laughs> probably that's something that I should do next. Okay, try out uh, VS Code and its extensions. So I do have that. I have actually a video on my favorite Visual, t uh, Visual Studio Code extension, so check on that one leave a toxic workplace. Um, happily, I was not in a toxic workplace, so uh, I don't have a check there. And hopefully no one has to be in that situation. So next one, contribute to an open source project. Um, I want to do that, so so far it's not a check. So uh, 14, learn a fundamentally different programming language. So that's what I did, like I will have a check here. So. I am experienced with C Sharp. I've been developing in C Sharp for the last eight years. And earlier this year, I left my job to learn something differently, <laughs> different than what I was doing. So I learned JavaScript uh, from C Sharp and then I learned uh, Python. So check on that one. Um, 15, deploy a serverless function. Um, it's something that I hope to do. Um, it's on my to do. So not check that. I don't, I don't have it. Uh, 16, learn GraphQL concepts. Um, I need to do that. 17, build a Jamstack application. I don't even know what's that. So it's JavaScript API and markup application consisting of those technology. Um, so I'll have to check it out. I'm not sure if I have a check or not. Um, 18, move a, a look. Oh, <laughs> 18, have a look at Wasp top um, 10. I remember looking at this. Oh my God, I do remember uh, listening to a podcast about it. So I need definitely to read it. So I don't have a check there. Um, 
do more pair programming. Oh my God, I did so much pair programming during the six months that I did the bootcamp. So I think I definitely have a check there. Um, 20, opt-in code reviews. I did a lot of those um, and I hope to do those in the future again. Uh, <laughs> 21, focus on problem solving. That's one of the skills that all of us as software developers should focus on. We need to brush on them. We constantly have to, to be better pro problem solver. So, oh my God, that's the wine talking or that's the champagne that not me. Um, hopefully can pronounce that. Focus on problem solving. Okay. Um, 22, learn how to debug. Oh my God, that's definitely a really good tip. Debugging is really important. So. I do have a check there, I would say, but uh, I still want to continue to learn on that. 23, don't sell yourself short. Um, that's something that I need to work on. So it's kind of a half and half there. Next, uh, learn from your failures. So, well, that's what I'm doing right now. I failed my Google interview and I'm looking at ways to improve myself. So I'm learning from my failures. Being serious, I definitely will look back at what did I do wrong or what did I do well, what I didn't do so well and what needs, uh, I need to work on and improve. 25, always test your code. Good tip. Testing is important. Learn design patterns. Great tip. Tick there. Uh, don't hesitate to ask for help. Tick, 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 tick. I have all of those. Check. I never hesitate asking for help. 28, attend a technical conference. I attended many technical conferences, so I have checked there. Speak at the technical conference. I do have, I spoke at Seattle Code Camp and I spoke at ACTW conference. So I do have check, check there. Um, try to stay relevant. So that's what I tried to do this year by by learning something new. I learned something that is relevant in the job market right now, kind of like web development and so on. So I did the bootcamp. I continue learning, continue reading books, watching tutorials and pot listening to podcasts and so on. So uh, 31, be open-minded. Um, so I try to be open-minded. It's a, it's, a, <laughs> I think it's a tick, but a check, but I'm not sure. Join a community, uh, check, become a specialist. It's something that I'm working on. Ship something. Um, I don't have a check there. Practice regularly. That's what I'm trying to do. So check, uh, start a personal project, check, finish a, pro a personal project. Um, check <laughs> take a new course check read more books check support other people check so by supporting other people in this case i am a mentor with mint program i have two ment mentees that i meet with them regularly and i try to to be a good mentor so hopefully <laughs> that's support to other uh, learn to analyze problems that's really important skills i agree with that refactor at codebase i've done that check Meet new people, check. Enjoy your life. <laughs> That's really important as a software developer or any profession that you have, you need to enjoy your life. Um, don't listen to others too much. Um, check and not check. Um, 46, take some time off social media. Check, check, check. I, I try to do that all the time. Um, 47, check, uh, create a social media account. Check. Create a LinkedIn account. Check. Uh, take care of your social account, social accounts, um, check, um, build a solid foundation. So, um, and, okay. That's something that I'm continuously working on. So with no check there, 51, take advantage of free resources. I definitely do that. So check, check, check there. Um, 52, find your niche. That's something in progress. So I'm trying to work on that. Uh, 53, learn how to learn best. I definitely, um, it's a work in progress. I'm working on that and actually have a few books to kind of how to learn to learn. Um, 54, learn to appreciate failures. Well, that's what I'm doing right now with you. Thank you for being with me in this moment. Um, learn to celebrate success. Um, I'm learning to do that. Uh, 56, just start coding. It's a good, good, <laughs> good advice. So just learn coding. Um, check. Uh, contribute to a stack overflow, not check. Uh, find great tools. Uh, I'm working on that. So it's, I found a few that works for me, some that don't work. So I work on that. So check. Customize your IDE. Definitely check. Develop a new product. Um, working on something. Create your own tools. Uh, working on that. Write a book. Honestly, <laughs> I actually, that's what I'm doing. I've been working on 
my book, writing a book uh, about interviewing process and how to do great at interviews and so on. So if you're interested, um, stay tuned, but I'm writing my book. How crazy is that? But okay, um, next, 63, create a library. Uh, I didn't do anything like that. Uh, 64, learn to listen to others. That's really important. And that's one of the skills that I recognize that I have to improve on. So I need to learn to, learn to listen to others. Um, 65, communicate clearly. That's one thing that I'm working on. And um, one of my top goals is to communicate clearly. So trying to work on that. 66, share unfinished work. I'm not doing that. I need to work on that. 67, answer where questions I've done some of those. So um, 68, become a domain uh, expert um, in progress. And <laughs> 69, get a promotion. I did get the promotion and you will hear about that soon. <laughs> um, 70, take some time off. Yep, I will take some time off when I feel like it. <laughs> no, I'm taking some time off. Um, so uh, 71, inspire others. I hope this channel is meeting this criteria. I'm trying to inspire others, so hopefully. 72, work with SQL database, check. 73, work with non-SQL database, uh, not check. Um, I want to work on something like that. 74, learn how to research. That's something in progress. 75, learn how uh, learn about accessibility. Um, so I don't know anything like that. So that's something that I should check. 76, learn about Kubernetes. I haven't done anything like that. Write useful comments. That's something I need to improve on. Um, get a new, a new certification. Um, I do have a lot of those on LinkedIn. So that's something that is awesome. And I have a LinkedIn learning prof like account and I constantly use that to improve and get new certifications. I definitely recommend you doing the same. 79, practice authorization and, and authentication. I've done that. There's still room for improvement. 80, take care of API security. Um, done that. Write good emails. That's something in progress. So uh, a check. Uh, don't be a gatekeeper. Um, so I'm, I do my best to, to not be a gatekeeper. Um, follow great people. I do have people that I really admire and follow them. Uh, take new risks. So leaving my job, learning something new, that's definitely a risk. That was really not easy to do, but check there. Learn about machine learning. Um, something that I want to do, but I haven't done yet. 86, stay humble. humble. I'm not sure I try to do that, but it's uh, I can say that I'm humble, but it's up to other people to actually tell me if that's true or not. 87, track your progress. I'm trying to do that, so check. 88, learn how to utilize documentation um, in progress. 89, choose quality over speed. That is definitely something that I know and I work on, so it's check. Participate in the job interview. Oh my God, I did a lot of them, so check, check, check. <laughs> now you want to help others to prepare for an interview. Uh, and that's kind of what I'm doing with this YouTube interview tag um, videos that I'm doing and posting. Hopefully my experience and everything that I'm sharing with you, it's something that helps you prepare for interviews. So hopefully that checks uh, that um, criteria. And I need to invest in yourself. That's what I've done and this year. I invested a lot of time in learning new skills, new technologies and uh, many other things. So check. Invest in your tools. Um, check. Try to work from home. Check. Get a remote job. Check. <laughs> Find a job with a purpose. Um, check. Join a startup. Check. I think you get the hint. Uh, apply for a new job. Check. Join a coding bootcamp. Check. <laughs> Explore cloud technologies. Um, that's a check. Uh, never give up. Check. So those were 101 tips, right? Uh, what did he say? 101 tips to make you a better developer. So let's see, I will count all of them and kind of see how good did I do. And yeah, thank you, Simon, for this <laughs> article that you wrote. Um, I hope that it's something that you will find uh, entertaining to look at and kind of see what is your score. I decided to make it this a game because I just wanted to have a feel good moment, kind of celebrate getting a rejection today and not letting the that rejection define my day and how I feel and what I do next. And hopefully uh, you found something <laughs> interesting in this video. 
I'm definitely interested in seeing your score. So make sure to leave your score in the comments and I will appreciate this having something that we do all together. Thank you very much. i see you in the next video and make sure to like, comment, share and subscribe if you haven't done so. I have a lot of great ideas that I want to share with you. So make sure that you are your notification bell is on so you don't miss those ideas that will be uploaded soon. So see you soon. Bye bye.